Hey everybody, welcome to Fashion Friday. We're going to be getting all kinds of real in this video. So this kind of is going in with the theme of what we talked about a couple weeks ago where I talked about why your style needs to evolve. We're going to talk today about a style symptom of a crappy life. I'm going to be doing a series of these. What do these style symptoms mean? So this is the first one. This style symptom is people that are wearing the same thing they've been wearing for the last 10, 20, and 30 years. Hear me out. If you look at my outfit right now, it's not that uncommon from things that I have worn in the past. However, it is a higher quality, it is put together in a more thoughtful manner, and it's also newer. If you're wearing the same ratty t-shirts from high school, from college, from whatever, throw them out. We all know that guy. We know the guy who's in the dead-end job, who's wearing the same clothes from college, who can't keep a relationship together. Maybe they're living with roommates in their 30s and 40s. Like, we know these people. And one of the symptoms of someone not having their life together is people that have been wearing the same outfits for 10, 15, and 20 years. If you're watching this video, I'm assuming that you were between the ages of 18 and 80, because that is my demographic. And I also would assume that you guys have had some kind of evolution in your lifestyle, be it maybe you're going from middle school to high school, maybe you're going from married to divorce, maybe you're going from engaged to married, maybe you had kids, maybe you changed your job, any of these things you need to change your clothes with every single step of the way. If you haven't changed your clothes in a while, take a look at your life. Has it evolved? Have you up-leveled in any way, shape, or form? The answer is no. Mm. 10 years ago, I was carrying a crappy purse from Target. Now I have a fairly nice stocked cabinet full of nice bags. 10 years ago, hell, even three years ago, I was not investing in denim. I was not investing in footwear, and I was constantly having jeans give out, and I was having the shoes rip. Investing in your clothing, changing up your clothing in a way that is more polished, these are things that show that you have evolved and you have leveled up. Everything in life is about moving forward. We don't need to hold on to clothes from 10, 15, and 20 years ago. If you are still wearing those clothes from 10, 15, 20 years ago, ask yourself, do I feel like these clothes serve me? If the answer is no, it's time to chuck them out. Do I feel like these clothes allow me to show that I have grown as a human being? If the answer is no, mm. it's okay to sleep in the shirt from South by Southwest from 2008, but maybe let's not wear it out in public. Maybe not until it becomes vintage and then your kids want to wear it or your dogs or whatever. But I want you to take a look around. If you have not evolved in your style, if you have not bought new things in the last decade, it is a sign that your life is flat like my friend. So, even if it's in the same vein of what you're wearing, figure out a way where you can up-level that. If you have jeans that have holes in them that aren't cool, go out and buy new jeans. Go invest in some new jeans. Maybe it's spending $50, $60 more than you would on jeans, but it's time to upgrade. It's time to level up. If you're in high school and you're buying stuff at Forever 21, maybe it's time to take that new stuff that's going to college and move on to Nordstrom Rack. Maybe it's time to get some cooler things in your closet that are what adults wear. We don't need to be shopping in the junior section. We don't need to be shopping in the fast fashion anymore. All of my people are college aged and older. Let's dress like adults. Our version of adult. This is my version of adult. Corduroy hat, mustard yellow, Indian tassel necklace, and bell bottoms. But designer jeans, paid 50 bucks for them, but they were on sale. Designer top, got it at Goodbye Girls. It was like 35, 40 bucks. Necklace that I got, ring from a local designer, some nice jewelry, not some just costume jewelry, and a cool hat. Same stuff I'd be wearing, and if Peyton from 10 years ago saw me now with this outfit and the purse that I carry with it, she would go, that girl's got her act together. I can't wait to meet her. Dress in a way where yourself from 10 years ago would be excited to meet you now. Is there stuff hanging around in your closet that doesn't need to be there? If so, cut it out. I will talk to you guys next week. I love you so much. You wear it well.